Salutations, my ladies and gentlemen. This is Evelina Manny, back with another Irish rant. And as you can tell from my fake Irish accent, this is how you can tell when I'm going to get very, very angry. So, and what I have to get angry about today is... Pretty much Facebook. Yes, as I know and I'm aware of entirely that everyone has made a video about how Facebook irritates the holy heck out of them. I am no different. But, let's put it this way. I do not care if you like Facebook or not. But, if you do, if you do and you hate this video, please read the bloody shirt. You read it? Good. So this rant can start. First of all, the reason why Facebook gets under my nerves <laughs> Why does the NSA get under my nerves? Why does life in the tent get under my nerves? Oh brat. I swear to God. I don't want to say anything negative because I think my partnership will be terminated if I do. Even though I don't think you two pay so much attention. Anyways, this video is going to be titled, as you see from the bottom, Facebook Stupidity. Starting off with the ads. Oh my god almighty, the ads. What is it with the ads? I mean, there's only a few ways to get rid of them. You either like them, and of course you can always click that little X that's like right, maybe on the left, right hand side and click that little thing and goes away. But you have to come up with some cockamamie reason and to why you don't like it. Let's just put it this way. You know, the people who own Facebook on that end? The reason why I don't like it is because I don't like it! Okay? I don't like it! Go away! Show! Beat it! Just like the song. Just beat it. Anyways. Second phrase. Second thing I don't like about Facebook. And I really dislike. Is the Pokey game. Even though I went. When I first started it. And this is this has nothing to do with. And you know who you are. I'm not annoyed by you. There's so much. You're fine. I will say, there are a few people that are getting on my nerves, and you know who you are. Stop it. Okay? Stop it. Anyways. Part of the reason why it annoys the heck out of me is, one, seriously, Facebook, do we need to be able to poke each other virtually? I mean, kids do that already at home. Heck, I could do that to my parents. Of course, I'm sure pretty soon they'll just come back and slap me in the face if I do it too much. But, let's put it this way. I would rather do it where in actual reality than on a reality. Uh, and virtual reality. You can get what I mean. I'd rather do it there than I'd rather do it here in the real world where I'm poking someone and you know they get annoyed they can tell me to stop face to face. Wow. On Facebook? Seriously. Give it a rest. Okay but folks? Give it a rest. Stop poking me. I don't like it. Stop. Done. 
unless unless you are in completely stupid. No offense, I don't want to call anyone completely stupid, but unless you are completely dumb in that way, stop it. Just stop. The lady said stop. No means no. I thought we all learned that. But the 90s taught us that. No means no. Done. Okay. Next thing. Wait. Okay. His friend's request. Now, of course, I don't mind it from someone I know from, you know, way back, you know. If we went to elementary school, may I wouldn't mind friending you, depending on the situation. If I don't remember you, and it's been well over ten years, don't bother. I'm not... The thing is, it's not that I don't care about your opinion, or you, per se. It's just that it's great that we knew each other in elementary school, but... Elementary school could be pre-K, where I was just little and just stuck in my thumb. And I only remember you and I sat at the same table one time. Now, see, that's where I got to draw the line. If I can't remember you from that one time, it's best not to bother. It just chew. I'm sorry, but chew. And I don't want to to tell anyone to not be friends with me on that level, but it's just not going to work. It, that's not a solid relationship in the first place. It's just like, in real life, if you walked up to me and I didn't remember you from that one incident, I think it's better that we're not friends. I think the same should be applied to Facebook. Okay, and number three. Yeah. Flying across the, f the screen. <laughs> Anyways, number three. Hey. I will be honest. I hate the e cards. They were funny before. They were very interesting and funny. You know, I got I mean, I like the fact the 50s could be funny for once. But. You know, when I was growing up, the 50s were cool, you know, it was the retro, cool decade for it, and, but still, just stop it, just stop it, okay, just fucking stop that, alright, just stop it, it's not funny anymore, okay? <sighs> Um, another thing, I have a bad habit of this, and this is not Facebook's fault, please, if you could, add a dislike button, it really would not be a bad idea, I like to click the down button so I can say I hate something, especially after I clicked like, when I agree to it, you know, sometimes I click like, because I just don't know what else to put, you know, they don't really give you any option other than maybe say, oh, well, you can either comment, like, or share. And the thing is, if I know nothing of the article, then what the fuck? What? Part of my language, but still, what the X? then, you know, I can't comment on it. And the thing is, I get so much stuff on Facebook, as it is. It's not that I don't want anyone talking to me on it if they want to. Like, if you're coming and you look at my videos and just want to have a conversation, sure. But we leave it at that. I don't want you... I really would not want you sending a lot of stuff, especially personal stuff. Keep that to, with you. That, that's your thing. I kind of feel like Facebook needs to have its boundaries, and people don't put their own boundaries there. That's part of the problem. Sorry, but that is a problem in our country. We don't know when to give boundaries. However, then the next thing would be 
Ricky. Sorry, I gotta scratch my head. Gee, that clock tower goes really fast. Anyways. Also, just as a rule of thumb, not everything on Facebook is something you should click like on or even bother with. You know, you just don't. Really don't. Don't send it to me if it's like save a chinchilla thing. I do care about the environment and I do plan on doing a video about my environmental side and how I take care for it. However, do not send me a hope. Try if you're going to do that, please check your sources, okay? Please. I really don't like the idea of someone sending me something about how to save the chinchilla and really it's just a bunch of people looking for money, okay? I hate that. I hate you begging. Okay? We all hate it. It's I mean, I guess I'm, what I'm doing right now is e-begging, but it's still irritating to do that through Facebook. It's not even real. Um, I guess another thing that's really irritating about Facebook is games. I mean, I like the games. They're fun sometimes, but they go on for what goes on. Forever and ever and ever and ever and ever. It's like, just stop. You know, you know, in 20 years, we're going to have to figure out how to deal with all these uh, Facebook game addicts because God only knows everyone's addicted to it now. At least one or two games. And, well, I guess that's it. Sorry, I don't have any more stuff. Anyways, this is my Irish rant for today. And this is Evelyn O'Malley. Sign out. Peace. 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 So, click down, down in the description box to follow me on Twitter, Tumblr, and check out my fanfic picks in the next few days. Well, not a few, next few days. Friday. I should have something out there. Sorry it's taking so long. And uh, don't forget to click subscribe and follow me on my YouTube channel and everywhere else. Peace! Again.